We choose freedom, we choose equality, we choose democracy, and we choose a European Commission that will stand up for this freedom. When I wake up next to my girlfriend in the morning and I'm filled with happiness and gratitude, I sometimes ask myself, how can you hate that the two of us love each other? When I see beautiful pictures from gay weddings, I ask myself, how can you hate this kind of joy? And when I see a young trans person living a life as their true authentic self, I ask myself, how can you hate someone just for wanting to be who they are? In Europe today, we are faced with a choice. A choice between a Europe of freedom, of equality and diversity, where I can love and care for my girlfriend, where two men can get married, and where a young trans woman can live her life without being afraid of violence or discrimination. And a Europe of hatred and oppression, driven by Orban and Kaczynski and other people on this continent, where governments sponsor homophobic campaigns to cover up their systemic corruption, where our community is used as a distraction from the blatant failures of government politics. Between a Europe of freedom and a Europe of hatred and oppression, the choice is very clear. We choose freedom, we choose equality, we choose democracy, and we choose a European Commission that will stand up for this freedom. For the freedom of trans people in Hungary, for the freedom of judges in Poland, for the freedom of everyone in the European Union to love who they want to love and to be who they are.